pulled the trigger on this tool. And let's get into this. I ordered it online. And of course, I recently found out that my store just got it in stock, so I would have definitely picked it up in the store. But I picked up the, uh, the angle grinder. I do also want to get the inline grinder, but this one uh, is definitely first on the list. Of course, more wrenches. I'm sure uh, you've probably seen plenty of reviews on this, but those are the RPM settings. Let's get a battery. Nice with the variable uh, speed. Get a nice light. Definitely seems pretty decent. I say uh, I want to try this out on something. All right, so I've got a little project today. I'm working on a uh, Altima, changing out the uh, the cap with the new one. I love this one. Got it all apart. Oh yeah? Figured this would be a good time to test this out. Got a little crooky disc on there. And get some of this uh, gunk off. Old, uh, looks like some gasket makers on it. But, see how it does. Let's give it a little test.
He's in there. Well, well done. Back to the old. Not too bad. Can you show me all my walnuts? Obviously, I gotta clean off the new one too. Get this uh, fluid off here. Perfectly. Quick disc, probably not the best uh, for this. Maybe like a sanding disc or a, a Rolock uh, bristle. But Daddy, yeah, hold on, Mo. hold on a second. And uh, I'm not going to be inserting this. This is really not needed for this uh, the mounting surface. So I'll just be using these three. Use a new. Uh, crush uh, washer and all that but it came with a new gasket probably clean the surface up with it and uh, yeah and uh, I also recently got a new uh, piston caliper for my Cadillac I tried to uh, or I was bleeding the brakes and of course on the last bleeder to uh, you bleed the inside first and then the outside it snapped off so I tried to re drill and tap it out got it out but I had to make the hole bigger so I had to retap it and it's just leaking a tad bit I mean it probably work but it was breaking I don't uh, want to mess with that I don't want to really mess with that and uh, it's a big safety issue so I just went and got another one so I'll be installing that eventually Money I didn't really want to spend, but oh well. At least it looks fresh. Well, back to this project. All right, so I made a couple stops today. I stopped by Harbor Freight, and I picked up this five pack of tray liners. This was uh, four dollars and forty nine cents. At these. 24 piece button cell batteries. I really only need it for this bottom portion, but I've uh, got a couple tools that they need. And this was only uh, $3.29. The wing nut assortment for $5.99. And this uh, painter's tool for $2.87. I like to keep these foam brushes just for touch up and whatnot. That's a six piece for dollar seventy nine. I've seen this. We're gonna try this out. It's the fairly new item, I guess. Seven hundred fifty lumens. It's a rechargeable swivels and all that. Uh, it's magnetic base. Yeah, this was normally twenty nine ninety nine. And you can use the 20% off coupon on it, which brought it down to $23.99. So not bad. I also stopped by Home Depot, picked up some wood. Uh, Going to make a shelf for our TV downstairs on the wall. I picked up some uh, screws. That, these are some general screws that I use. Two inch and one and a quarters, number eights. Got some more wall patch. Patch up a little hole that's on the bottom of the wall. And uh, edging brush. And this is what I'm going to paint the shelf with. This weathered gray look. I like that. But uh, let me crack this open and see if I get a little test of it. We got it cracked open. Definitely has a little bit of weight to it. And it feels good. So I got some, this is like a rubberized molding around it. I guess you could drop it. Hopefully it's a little durable. It is a micro USB charge. Let's see how bright this thing is. 
this is as dark as I can get it for now but uh, it's got three modes and that's low got a little battery indicator on the back as well that's nice it's off medium and high definitely definitely is bright if you're working on the wheel well or something it's nice and it is magnetized as well it's got a nice strong bat um, magnet on it nice swivel but definitely strong I think it's definitely worth it for 24 bucks.